Hi guys, um, not much chance of doing any flying at the moment. The weather here is really terrible. So uh, I thought I'd just give you an update on what I'm doing so you can see what I'm gonna be putting up on YouTube in the future. So um, I've been building my uh, my right wing mini drack. Um, haven't got that far with it really, but um, I think all the hard work's kind of done. So getting all of the spars in uh, and, and gluing the, uh, the main spars into the fuselage. Um, and I've just printed this, uh, this motor mount um, it's my, actually my first um, ABS 3D print, so I'm pretty pleased with that. This is a motor mount that was designed by uh, Josh Gort. Um, he kindly put it up on Thingiverse and uh, I've printed it and uh, it's specifically to mount this, uh, this badass um, 28, 14, 1300 kV motor, which is just, well, it's just a piece of art really. So uh, yeah, that fits into um, the back of the mini track and just fits like a glove. Um, he even had the forethought to print a channel to, to put the cables in to keep the cables nice and neat which I think is just incredible. So yeah the mini drag is coming on nicely. Um, I've uh, to go with the badass motor I decided that I wanted to uh, try one of these uh, these these gecko 85 amp PSCs. Now that's that's huge that's like a that really is like a brick. This is actually the same manufacturer that makes the um, the rebranded um, ESCs for uh, innovative designs that produce the badass motor so it's exactly the same ESC I think it's called the uh, the rebel or the renegade um, in their in their lineup but um, the other ESC I want to try is one of these uh, one of these APDs this is the APD 80 amp now compared to the you know this this ESC this is so much different so much lighter and smaller but apparently this is this should be able to handle um, the uh, the output um, or the, or the wattage requirements for the badass motor. So I'm gonna give that a try. I'm gonna put a heat sink or two on it and uh, probably mount it somehow so it gets plenty of cooling. Um, probably run with the, uh, the F405 or I might even go with the, um, one of the newer Matex. I've got a couple of these spare so I might use one of these or I might go for one of the, uh, the new Matex FCs with the new OSD, not really sure yet. Um, in terms of the, um, the servos, I've gone for these high tech. These are the HS, five to four five mgs and the reason why i went for those is because um you can put the uh, anodized aluminium arms on there and i really want that to to look really nice i'm going to um connect the um the elevons with these really quite heavy duty uh, rods and ball joints because I, obviously with this mini drag i don't want any play whatsoever in the uh, actual elevons so um yeah that's what i'm going to be doing with the with the mini drag um now I'm obviously a bit nervous about flying a mini drag, even though I have flown a few 6S planes, thrown the AR900 6S and also my AR Pro 6S. So um, I've actually um, just just bought the, um, the ZHOD, uh, ZOHD, sorry, Dart XL version 2 to replace this old girl. She's had a few crashes. So um, what I thought I would do, um, as you can see what I'm doing here is I'm designing a motor mount so I can put the badass motor on this Dart XL, uh, and then I can test these two AA, these two ESCs on 6S. So if it crashes, no big deal because I'm building a new one anyway. I hope it doesn't crash because I really love this plane. Um, but it'll give me a chance to try the powertrain. Uh, I've no idea how this this uh, this fuselage and this design of plane is going to handle that 6S power. Um, probably run it on the 7x6 prop, but it will give me the opportunity to make sure that the powertrain for the mini drag works. Uh, works well so that uh, the chance of crashing my dream plane is lessened. So yeah, it would be interesting to see what this is going to fly like. And I'll put a video up of that little adventure of going out and flying this uh, Dart XL with, uh, with 6S. So yeah, that's, that's the only update I can give you at the moment. It's uh, nothing else really to say. Um, I'm going to be busy in the workshop getting this together. Um, and then um, hopefully I'll see you guys online uh, when we we fly the uh, the badass XL. <laughs>